Meanwhile, across the hall in the Senate, Sonia Chang Diaz has made it official. She's running for governor. She's the third Democrat in the race right now. How do you see the lineup if Attorney General Maura Healey does not jump in, Marianne? This is going to be a long, hard, grinded out campaign, town by town, person by person, by a current state senator, a former state senator, and a professor. So it, in the long run, it could be a good thing for a general election, whoever emerges. But boy, it's going to be a slog it out race between the three of them. Rob? What do people look for in a chief executive and a governor? They look for somebody who is practical and has management experience, not somebody who's a hardcore progressive without management experience. So I, I think it's going to be a very long campaign. I think she's going to have a hard time convincing the 55 percent of unenrolled voters uh, who are moderates that, that she is a good choice. Next item is Fourth of July. It's, it's next weekend, but it's going to be an odd one here in Boston because the pops will be in Tanglewood. The fireworks will be in the common instead of the Esplanade. No crowds will be allowed. Will this stop the invasion into the city, Marianne? Yeah, it will. I mean, the <laughs> Esplanade is what pulls everybody in, so we'll see them next summer. Rob, what do you think? I don't know. People seem to be coming yeah. out of the woodwork <laughs> yeah. everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Where did all these people come yeah, from? So. Right. That's Tough to like they're looking yeah. for a party. And listen, yeah. you should see the line at the dump. I'm telling you, people just want to go out. Right, I know. Right, right. Okay, time for best week or worst week. Rob, we're going to start with you. Uh, my best week is Charlie Baker. Uh, proposing the two-month sales tax holiday, ho holiday is popular, and it positions his pen potential Democratic candidates to be against tax cuts in favor of more spending. Rob, I mean, Marion. <laughs> Best week, Claire Cronin's appointment as um, ambassador to Ireland. Not since somebody named Kennedy has anyone from Massachusetts gotten that kind of attention for an appointment to Ireland, a special relationship between Ireland and the state with all the Irish uh, population. It's clear that it not only does the musical chairs of the state house, but also, as we said, clears the way for Aaron Mikulitz to be speaker. Can you believe July 4th is next weekend? Woohoo! <laughs> and you know what? We're going to be saying it's Labor Day any minute before right you after even that. know it. Right absolutely. After that. Rob, Marianne, thank you. Folks, thank you for joining us. And remember, every Sunday we go on the record. Take care.